Hey guys, my name is Jason with Mount Baker Mining and Metals, and on today's video, we're going to be crushing some body parts through one of our 24 by 16 hammer mills here behind me. Currently, the hammer mill doesn't have any screen, so I'm going to put them in. They're going to fall down through, get bashed up, fall down onto this conveyor belt. The conveyor belt's going to take them all the way up here and into a bin, and we'll take a look at them once they're uh, shredded through our hammer mill. So here's the parts we're going to be running today, and these are actually replacement knees and hips and elbows and shoulders, stuff like that. Uh, and the goal here is to damage these so they can't be reused um, or, or copied or anything like that so they can be disposed of. And I think there's a whole mix of material here. Some of them is, uh, this is a cast part. I think there's some steel. I think there's some, uh, these are, I think these are titanium. They're pretty light. Uh, this is maybe a piece of stainless. Here also is a piece of stainless. I think they're, they're really heavy. Um, and then you have this stuff that's aluminum and probably another piece of titanium here. So um, again, our goal is just to destroy these, get them banged up and scratched up so they can't be used, and then they can be properly disposed of. So here's some of our parts after uh, run through the hammer mill with no screen. And they got dented up and dinged up a little bit. Um, but I want to see a little bit more destruction on these things. So now we're going to put a screen in and get a little bit more retention time. And see if we can destroy these parts a little bit more. Because some of them came through and they just barely got dented and dinged. So we really want to kind of mash these up a little bit more. All right, so here we'll take a look at uh, the stuff after we ran them through that two inch by four inch screen. And now it's a little bit more destruction. That's kind of what we were looking for. Got all the pieces dinged up. Some of them even broke up into, into smaller pieces, but everything's been dinged up and destroyed pretty good. So now these can all be, uh, be recycled and, and disposed of. so they can't be reused or copied or anything like that. So thanks for watching our video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, we have a bunch of other scrap processing videos. Uh, you can find those on our YouTube channel, so go check those out if you're interested. And if you guys have any samples that you'd like to see run through any of our equipment, go ahead and send us an email or shoot us a phone call, all of which you can find in our description below. So thanks for watching, and we'll see you on the next one.